Welcome to the Offshore Forex Broker List 2022. This video series covers U.S. Forex Trading Regulations, U.S. Forex Brokers, Expert Forex EAs and U.S. Brokers, Offshore Forex Broker Considerations, Offshore Forex Broker Lists 2022, this video. Finally, funding and withdrawing from offshore brokers. Before we get to subject matter, we have two important disclaimers to review. This first one is about risk. Futures, options, and currency trading all have large potential rewards, but they also have large potential risk. You must be aware of these risks and be willing to accept them in order to invest in these markets. Don't trade with money you can't afford to lose. This is neither a solicitation nor an offer to buy or sell futures, options, or currencies. No representation is being made that any account will or is likely to achieve profits or losses similar to those discussed in these videos. The past performance of any trading system or methodology is not necessarily indicative of future results. Since we are discussing brokers today, we must tell you that information presented in this video, the Expert Forex website, or any correspondence with Expert Forex is, to the best of our knowledge, true at the time of writing, and it is not a recommendation. Circumstances can change the validity of the information. Readers who use information we provide on brokers have the responsibility to conduct their own due diligence. As broker information is not a recommendation, Expert Forex and all associated with Expert Forex cannot be held liable for any losses incurred due to the use of this information. This 2022 update will focus exclusively on the broker lists as they stand in March 2022. Please refer to the original 2020 video for discussion on these unchanged topics. Repatriating money to the United States, taxation of trading income, and CFDs. The United States government can put pressure on any of these brokers to cease accepting U.S. clients or to close all U.S. client trading accounts at any time. This has happened many times in the past 12 years already, so potential offshore traders should be aware of the risk. Our linked due diligence thread reports that 98 out of over 100 brokers that made their original list ultimately ceased accepting U.S. clients and closed their accounts. Only one of the original brokers remains on their list. Dividing your trading accounts among multiple offshore brokers is a good mitigation strategy. The Baby Pips thread, Going Offshore to Escape the CFTC, is a great place to start due diligence. This thread is over 12 years old and has over 12,400 posts as this video got released. Look for brokers in Group 1, brokers that will continue to accept U.S. clients. Most of the brokers in this video are in this Group 1 list. Brokers on this list, with a double dagger, have earned the thread's trusted designation. Please pay heed to the historical notes section of the first post in The Baby Pips, Going Offshore to Escape the CFTC Thread. Quote, during the first year of this thread, from September 2010 to September 2011, we found and listed over 100 offshore brokers who, at that time, would accept new United States clients. One by one, 
all of those brokers, except two, have caved to pressure from the CFTC to sever ties with their U.S. clients. Of those original 100-plus brokers, only Renesource Capital remains on the current list. Offshore brokers, that's what you came here for. This list is presented in alphabetical order. Comments will focus on a unique aspect of a broker, such as offering MT5, CFD selections, high leverage, fixed spread, and cent accounts. New traders should focus on FX, that is Forex. Unique aspects will be shown in bold and links to each broker will be provided in the video description. Two regulated brokers accept United States clients. First is Equity Capital, regulated by Jordan. In addition to Forex, Equity has an extensive selection of CFDs, both rolling and with expirations, including several minor stock indices and metals versus various currencies. Funding and withdrawal is by bank wire only. This broker is used by Top Step FX for funding their prop firm trader accounts. Second is number one capital markets. N1CM, regulated by Vanito. They have a maximum leverage of 1,000 to 1. They offer Forex, metals, commodities, indices, and stock CFDs. They offer cent accounts. However, demo accounts are not available for cent. Demos are fixed at $50,000. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Now we move on to the unregulated brokers. AAFX out of St. Vincent and the Grenadines. They offer a maximum leverage of 2,000 to 1. Forex, metals, indices, commodities, and cryptocurrencies, both MT4 and MT5. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Next is Cedar FX also out of St. Vincent and the Grenadines. You can trade Forex, metals, oil, indices, stock share CFDs, and cryptocurrencies. You have the choice of no commission or pay a small commission and that money goes to planting trees. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Coinex out of St. Vincent and the Grenadines is a former crypto-only broker that acquired FinPro Trading. They offer MT4 and MT5. Funding and withdrawal is by cryptocurrencies only. Some CFDs are processed as Forex and may have other non-standard characteristics. Eagle FX out of Dominica offers Forex, indices, and cryptocurrencies. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Forex Trading Pro out of Dominica. They are owned by the same entity as Traders Way, which ceased accepting U.S. clients. They offer a maximum leverage of 1,000 to 1. You can trade Forex, gold and silver, spot crude oil, and cryptos. No indices, no other commodities. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. FX Glory out of St. Vincent and the Grenadines. They offer a maximum leverage of 3,000 to 1. Forex pairs, oil, and metals. They offer a complete selection of metals, gold, silver, platinum, and palladium. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Henko Trade out of Seychelles. You can trade Forex, metals, oil, indices, stock share CFDs, and cryptocurrencies. They offer MT4 and MT5. 
you can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. LMFX out of Macedonia. They offer 1,000 to 1 leverage on variable spread only accounts, and they offer 400 to 1 on fixed spread accounts. Bank wires only for U.S. traders. No cryptocurrency deposits or withdrawals. A good selection of CFDs, but they come with one lot minimums that should not be traded with less than $100,000 in capital. LQDFX out of the Marshall Islands. They have a solid Forex and CFD selection, all available in 0.01 lot sizes. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Osprey FX out of St. Vincent and the Grenadines. They offer MT4 and MT5. You can trade Forex, metals, oil, indices, stock share CFDs, and cryptocurrencies. Metals include platinum. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Prosperity FX out of St. Vincent and the Grenadines. You can trade Forex, metals, oil, indices, stock share CFDs, and cryptocurrencies. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Sage FX also out of St. Vincent and the Grenadines. Dot mini suffixed instruments are cent based. They offer a broad selection of Forex, metals, and CFDs for stock shares, indices, and commodities. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Finally, Turnkey Forex out of Mauritius. They are owned by the Finvasa Group, which had FinPro Trading. They offer 85 Forex pairs. The complete selection of metals, gold, silver, platinum, and palladium. They are the only broker on this list to offer CFDs on exchange traded funds or ETFs. You can fund and withdraw via cryptocurrencies. Here is how cent accounts and cent instruments work. A $10 cent account has 1,000 cents and is traded as if it were a $1,000 account. A $100 cent account has 10,000 cents and is traded as if it were a $10,000 account. A $1,000 cent account has 100,000 cents and it is traded as if it were a $100,000 account. A normal account becomes a cent account when trading cent based instruments. These are denoted with a suffix. Cent instruments and normal instruments should not be mixed on the same account. Traders using expert Forex EAs on a $10,000 demo would follow the same exact risk profile with a $100 cent account. So why trade cent accounts? Traders with extremely limited capital can use cent accounts to get started far more quickly and gain valuable experience. Cent accounts are perfect for live testing EAs or manual trading systems with very small amounts of money. Cent accounts allow traders to build large portfolios of EAs to test with real money on live accounts. Choosing a system is much faster and more efficient because many systems can be tested simultaneously. Cent accounts give live trading experience that a demo cannot give. Trading psychology is different when working with real money at risk versus the monopoly money of a demo account. Cent accounts are fun to trade. Cent accounts do have some limitations. Only two brokers offer cent accounts or instruments to U.S. traders. Spreads are high on cent accounts. Remember, brokers are in business to make money. 
Your $10 set to count takes just as much resources and requires just as much support as a normal account. Simple math. Traders cannot expect to earn serious income using set accounts unless they are trading a multitude of them. A $100 set account might be traded like a $10,000 account, but it is still a $100 account. When you double a $100 set account, it will be a $200 account. Computing resources and infrastructure must be carefully considered if you are building a large portfolio of set accounts. This video provided a list of offshore brokers for you to start due diligence with. This list is current as of March 2022 and is subject to change without notice. We introduce cent accounts to build a trading portfolio quickly with small capital. Our final video in this series will cover funding and withdrawing from offshore broker accounts. Thank you for watching.